Hey Facebook, Mike Mazik here, and today I'm excited. I want to share with you guys how to target the members of a Facebook group, like a private Facebook group that you don't own. So um, I know that a lot of people say that this can't be done, but I'm going to actually show you how to do it. Um, so again, how to target the members of a private Facebook group. Now you do have to be a part of the Facebook group, so you have to be like in that group just so you know, um, but how to target the members of a group that you don't own. I'm gonna show you how to do that today. Uh, before I get started, listen, for any of you that are wanting to take your real estate business career to the next level, go to careerswithmike.com. Uh, I know a lot of you have been reaching out and contacting me, wanna kinda of find out how I can help you out. Um, maybe you wanna receive this type of training on a regular basis. So again, just go to careerswithmike.com. Couple disclaimers before I get started. Number one, um, this was, I didn't come up with this, this was taught to me by a guy by the name of Brad Bearden. Brad is the chief marketing officer for Frank Kern. I'm, I've been working very closely with Frank's team on a lot of things with my business and social media strategy. So again, this, I didn't come up with this. I like to always give credit where credit is due. Um, number two, just a, a disclaimer regarding like, my goal in this video is not to discuss whether or not this is like ethical, okay? Um, I'm gonna let you decide that. I'm gonna show you how it can be done. Um, but I'm not gonna, I don't wanna talk about whether or not like this is right or wrong or anything like that. I'm gonna let you decide. Um, I know that there's probably, a, you can go 50-50 there with a lot of you watching this. I will tell you this, I think that um, you can, if, if you wanna do this, most of you could probably just ask one of the owners or moderators of the group that you wanna do this in and probably work out some type of arrangement as far as you know compensation, something like that. Like if there's ever a doubt on whether or not you feel like you should do this, I guarantee you that 90% of the time you'd be able to you'd be able to get permission if you just go to them first. So anyway, with that being said, um, so how to target the members of a Facebook group. So number one, uh, let's just say you've got the group over here, right? And then you've got your business page over here, okay? So what you're gonna do first is you are going to create a video okay on your business page okay you're gonna create a video on your business page now listen before you check out because I know a lot of you watching this you don't like to do video I'm gonna show you how to do video without you being on video so we'll get there don't worry about that but we have to do a video and I'll tell you why in the later but you're gonna create a video on your business page you're going to then share that video onto the group so it's just something relevant that would pertain to the people that are in that group, right? So now, what you do is you go into Facebook in the back end, and what Facebook does is it has what's called custom audiences, okay? So within custom audiences within Facebook is where you can create audiences of people based on how they have interacted with either your, your still image post or, and that's what we're gonna talk about today, how much of one of your videos they have actually watched. Okay, so this is how you do it. And that's the reason why we're gonna do video. So what you're gonna do in custom audiences, it gives you the ability to create an audience for everybody that has watched either, I think it's three seconds, 10 seconds, 25%, I think it's 50%, and then maybe it's like 75% or more of any video that you've created, okay? So, all you're gonna do is create a custom audience that's based around the people that have watched this video that you shared to that group. And what's gonna happen is, you're gonna to begin to siphon off the people that have watched that video that you shared to that group. Now, um, a couple things here. So you might be wondering, okay, well, yeah, but also people that are on my business page are going to see this video as well. So it's gonna be commingled with people on my business page and, and people in the group. Well, I'll tell you this, unless you put money behind this on your business page, very few people are ever gonna see it unless you've got like hundreds of thousands of people on your business page, which I know most of you don't. Okay, but I will show you another way to do that before I end this video. So, now, like I said, why does this need to be video? Because if you post a still image ad, okay, it doesn't, you don't get these options. If you post a still image to your page, 
and then share it to the group. You can only build a custom audience off of the people that like or interact with that post, okay? Now, whereas we just wanna be able to build a custom audience if they've even viewed three seconds or more. Now, listen, I'm gonna show you how to put this on steroids, okay? This is really cool. So, let's say that you want to siphon off more people out of this private group. I'm gonna show you how to do that. What if we could, we could hack the Facebook system and we wanted to create a custom audience from everybody who's only watched one second of this video. So literally it's on their screen for one second. Okay, I'm gonna show you how to do that. So here's what you do. And this is especially helpful for all of you who don't like doing videos, okay? What you're gonna do is you're gonna create a, take a still image post, okay? So in other words, anytime, maybe you're gonna do one of those like quote posts, something like that, or what I would do if I were you, is I would actually create one of those posts that you know you always see in these groups that like everybody interacts with. It's maybe a controversial post or something like that. If you're in real estate right now, maybe you're gonna put a post out on, you know, um, what do you think about flat fee listing real estate agents or discount agents, you know, A, uh, I love them, or you know, maybe like this post if you love them, hearted if they're the best thing ever, frown face if you think they all need to get out of the business. Or even, I think you all understand what I'm saying. It's those posts that you always see that everybody just gives their little comment. You can tell that the people that posted it, they don't really care, they only posted it because they know they're gonna get a lot of likes and comments, right? So do something like that with a still image, okay? And, but instead of posting it as a still image, do a screen recording, okay, of that still image for four seconds, okay? Some of you already know where I'm going with this. You're gonna do a screen recording of that still image for four seconds. Then you're gonna share that still image. Actually, it's a video at this point, right? Because it's a screen recording. But you're gonna share that video slash, you know, I'll call it a screen recording. You're gonna share that screen recording to this group. Everybody that sees it in the group, they're not gonna realize that they're watching a video. They're gonna think that they're looking at a still image post. But what that allows you to do, because you did it for four seconds, now you can go in and what is 25% of four seconds, okay? It's one second. So now literally anybody that views that still image screen recording for one second on their computer is gonna be siphoned off into your custom audience which then you can take and you can run ads and posts and all kinds of other stuff too. So this is a really cool trick. It's a Facebook hack for you guys. Um, I know a lot, I always get this question, like can you target the members of a Facebook group with ads? And so the answer is no, but yes, you can. And so what I would do is I would actually do this, depending on how large this audience is, I would do this for maybe you're gonna post, do the same thing once a week, twice a week, if it's a really big group, maybe you're gonna do it for, it might take you know, 30, 60, 90 days of continually doing this, and you will have built up an enormous audience out of that group of just the people that are in that private Facebook group. So anyway, I hope that this makes sense to all of you out there. Um, if not, just message me or write your questions in the comments or anything like that. But again, I just wanted to show you guys how you can do that, because most people say that it can't be done, but it can. Um, and again, for any of you out there who are wanting more help with your real estate business, um, just go to careerswithmike.com. I'd love to talk to you about what all we're doing and just to show you guys everything that I can do to help you out. Um, talk to you later.